<laughs> you know horror games, right? They've been around for decades, and it's no secret that they're pretty scary. So I'm gonna make one in Roblox. This was going to be an interesting game, because for years I've actually wanted to make a realistic horror game. If this game was going to be realistic, I needed realistic models. So I spent about 3 hours modeling a single door. But then I decided I needed a door frame too. And of course, I needed a realistic window to go along with my realistic door. Honestly, these turned out a lot better than I expected, and would actually fit perfectly with the realism I was going for. But when it came to scripting the door... Oh my god, bro. Oh, and we're done. At least I hope so. Then I scripted the window, made a flashlight, and added more to the house. Then I added a garage for some reason. Maybe there's a secret behind the garage door? Who knows? Maybe you'll have to play the game and find out for yourself. But then I added a power box that would tie in with the story of the game later. I realized that the house was looking really empty, but of course, I was too lazy to actually model some furniture, so I took some from my old games. These would work fine for what I was going for. And besides, I'm not spending another 3 days modeling a microwave. But either way, I hadn't even made the actual game yet, so I began working on the game module. After some intense scripting, I cooked up a story to go along with my game. I chose to make it short and sweet, just a small little horror game that's fun to play. I added more elements to the story, finished up the scripts, and put everything in place. And now, after almost 3 weeks, I finished it. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like and subscribe. It really does help me out a lot. See ya.